Welcome to another Mindset Monday with Posh. Today, I want to talk to you about owning your power. Everyone has a source of inner power that fuels them. It is the strength that we draw from to overcome obstacles. But many of us aren't aware of what makes us powerful. The problem is we tend to not see ourselves as capable, dynamic, or even influential. We dwell on our faults and mistakes and this diminishes us and eventually we let our power slip away. Today, I want to challenge you to reconnect with yourself and own your power. Here are three things you can do to own your power. Find your power source. This is where you discover what power looks like to you. You have to pay attention to what lights you up. When you feel excitement, when you're talking about something, that is passion. And that is where your power lies. Pay attention to the things that makes you feel awake and alive and then feed them. So find your power source. Have you ever received a compliment and you made it seem like, oh, it's not a big deal. This is something we often do when we have limiting beliefs. We tend to find it hard to accept praise from others. But today, I want you to accept any praise that you receive from anyone. I want you to say, I am worth it, I am worthy, and I want you to accept those praise. When someone compliments you and tell you something nice, trust them, believe them, and know that you have earned it. So accept all praise. Surround yourself with powerful people. This doesn't necessarily mean CEOs of big companies. There are plenty of people within your own life not e even if it's not within your direct circle, maybe within your community, that can be pillars of power. Maybe you met someone at a networking event that was super confident, reach out to that person. There are also plenty of networking groups where you can join these groups and meet with others that are powerful in their own right, that have owned their power and this will encourage you to own your power. So join networking groups. Maybe there are podcasts that interviews powerful people. Listen to it, tune into it. Pulling these powerful people into your orbit can rub off on you. So surround yourself with powerful people. I want to challenge you to spend some time reconnecting with yourself and owning your power. Understand what lights you up, what you're passionate about. Hold on to these things and own your power. Thank you for tuning in to another Mindset Monday with Posh. I look forward to speaking to you next week as we work on your mindsets.